Hi friends, it's Nancy Jacobs here. Hey, today I'm going to share with you a project that I'm getting ready to do. I will let you know that I did get Emily's bathroom finished painting. Yay! The other thing is the kids, Emily and Tim, they've gone to school. Yesterday was their first day. Katie's off over in Europe getting ready for World Youth Day. So the house, it's quiet. I'm not used to this. Uh, Emily and Tim have been at home the last three years doing their schooling online. They'd go into the classroom two days a week, but the rest of their work they'd do at home. So this is going to be a big change having the house to myself again. So with everybody gone and it's quiet, I'm going to share with you my loft. It's a train wreck. It really is. And um, hopefully I'll be able to very soon show you some finished pictures but anyway let me show it to you now here it is this I share this area with the kids um, this area here uh, I got these cap this cabinetry at Lowe's or Home Depot one or the other and it just it fit in there nicely and then this Mike built the little table here that holds the TV and the printer and it's where the kids they watch TV so I share this area with them and then moving over here is my creative space and it's it's a constant train wreck I just and I I haven't done anything creative for a long time because I can't I can't keep the area clean and I wish I could say I could but it's just really hard uh, some of the cabinetry we got when we lived over in, in Germany and so it's been through several moves. I can't get the doors closed hardly so it's hard to open, hard to close, can't get to things. Um, just have miscellaneous some mismatched furniture. This is Katie's room here and with her being gone for two weeks I am going to take everything out of here. I'm going to completely clean it out move things into her room shortly they'll be they'll be out of there when she gets back and uh, then see if I can't totally reorganize this space I've got a couple ideas one is you know those little cubbies that they put the baskets in they make them in white and I'm thinking well that might work you know I could put rubber stamps in one basket I could put fabric in two or three other baskets so things like that that I think might work here's the if I keep turning this around here you can see it's just things are stacked on the floor and it's just hard to get around hard to do anything and it's hard to even feel creative um, another idea that I'm actually leaning towards if I can talk Mike into it so wish me luck here is the cabinets here that I got at Lowe's or Home Depot they're not expensive they're the ones that are in that are just on their shelves there and you, you assemble them yourself but I'm thinking maybe over here if I could get rid of a lot of this stuff put lower cabinets in down there and find just uh, oh you know just a scrap of countertop and put that on top I think that'd be really nice and who knows maybe even put some upper cabinets but I, I doubt it because I've got things up above already but at least get some lower cabinets and if I don't do the lower cabinets do the little cubbies because this is driving me nuts and I want to be creative I want to be creative and and do some things that I really enjoy so wish me luck on this <laughs> I appreciate it hey you guys have a great fantastic day uh, enjoy what's left of your summer here I will talk to you all soon God bless and thanks for watching bye bye